Hello and welcome to Color Up. Today, crazy times. I don't believe that there's a casino currently open in all of America. So what do you do? Well, you play with friends. The only problem with that, you can't do that because of social distancing. So you got to stay apart. So what if you played online with a friend over a video service such as uh, Skype or something like that? So that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to play with Rick from Let It Roll and we're going to play a little session over Skype and I'll show you how, how we do it. So it's real simple. You just use your, you know, your camera or your, uh, your phone. You both connect over Skype and you take turns rolling and then you just kind of bet on the other shooter and he calls out his rolls and, and, that, and that sort of thing. So it's a good way to have fun and I've actually done it with uh, some guys from Crafts Nation with up to like four or five different tables. So yeah, it's a good alternative if you can, uh, you know, if you have like a little layout or something, it doesn't have to be big, you know, maybe if you just have dice and chips and you can even kind of make your own layout if you don't have anything. But otherwise, you can get it on Amazon for a few bucks, um, you know, just something to, because I think a lot of us are going to have a lot of time on our hands where we're stuck in the house. So this might be an alternative for you. So let's go ahead and head to the tables and let's let it roll with Rick and uh, join him on Skype right now. Hey Rick, are you there? I'm here. I'm here. What's up, buddy? Hey, man. So, uh, yeah, thanks for everyone stopping in tonight. I kind of got my chat open here. This is the first time kind of doing this, and so we'll see how it goes here. Um, and uh, yeah, so Rick, maybe you want to explain what you're doing real quick, and then I'll do. Maybe you can roll first, and I'll uh, go. Sure. So what do you kind of... All right, guys. What I'm going to do is, is I'm going to go ahead and act like I'm at a $10 table. I'm going to buy in with $1,000. And I'm going to do... I don't know if you guys are subscribed to my channel or not, but on my last video, I did a strategy called All or Nothing. So that's what I'm going to be doing today in our rolls. I'm basically going to be placing all of the place bets plus the C and the E for three rolls. And I am going to play the come out. Um, after that, I'll regress to an amount that is under the amount I have profited if we make profit, if we get past three rolls. But my thought process is is that, you know, I mean, with the average roll being six to eight usually, I want to hopefully make uh, the first three rolls count. That's not saying a seven can't come in the first three, but that's what I'm looking to do. That's what I'm hoping for. What are you doing, Jerry? Well, I, I, I think I'm going to do what I did in the last video with the dice setter guy. I'm going to... Except for I'm going to do it just single unit. I'm going to go one unit across, um, and then maybe five rolls. I'll press any hits up and then and then pull it down or whatever. Um, just if you guys in the chat can let me know if you can hear us both okay. Um, I could adjust our volume a little bit, but <clears throat> just kind of let me know. So, uh, yeah, Rick, you want to go ahead and start off rolling? Yeah, let me get started here. I'm going to adjust the chat so I can see what's going on with it, too. Not sure. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do two units on the 4 and 10, three units on the inside, and then I'm going to do a $2 C and a $1 E. So as long as I don't throw a big red, I'm going to make money for the first three rolls. I'll press up each time. So are you ready, Jeremy? Yeah, I'm not sure where the echo's coming from with who, who it's from. Are they getting an echo? Yeah, from one of us. Hopefully it's not too bad. I could pull down your feed, your source. Let us know if you keep hearing the echo, guys. I'll talk continuously while it's working on it. You're fine. Echo is a little better. Yeah, I'm kind of further away from it and stuff. So um, I pulled it. So anyway, I have my 200 bankroll. I'm going to go across and working. Let me just give me a second to set up here, Rick. All right, just let me know when you're ready. And these bets are on. So anyway, so this is how we do it. We take turns, and so like Rick is going to f roll first. He'll call out. He'll call out the uh, the number, and then I'll mark it and pay accordingly. So that's how we kind of that's how we play together. Go ahead, Rick. All right, here we go, guys. I'm going to do the come out roll right now. I am working on the come out. Right 
Dice up. Okay, three, one, four. Point is four, so I'm going to score 18 minus my three. So really, I'm going to profit. Uh, oops, I shouldn't pay me for myself, should I? I should pay from the bankroll. I get paid nine, and I'm going to go ahead and press it up to 15. So win 18, lose three. So I'm going to replace these. Actually, that's going to be a buy in my book. Okay, I need two more rolls in order to make any money with the strategy. If, if I roll big red within the first three, I'm going to lose nine. Yeah, so if you're hearing a little echo, it's because I, I do have a, um, a speaker. Actually, it's on real low so I can hear Rick, but I have to be able to hear him make my calls. I don't know if I can run a headset or whatever. That's a five, three, eight, Jeremy. Eight. Take seven, and I'm going to go ahead and press that up. Lose these three. Just collect one. I get eight for the eight. I'm going to change that in to five so I can put my C and E back up. So I just need one more hit. I'm going to go ahead and press up my eight, three more units. I'm not going to change the greens because it'll take too long, so I'm going to leave it like that because I'm coming down after this one. So what do you do? And then you just do you just continue rolling or what do you so so what i do jeremy is is i'm gonna roll three times pressing twice okay so i pressed my nine on my first roll i pressed my eight on my second one because those are numbers i feel i hit more than not and now if i make it past this roll if big red don't show up on this roll i would have in in theory won between 40 and 60 dollars off of those first three rolls, and then I'm going to come down to about 22 inside, and then I'll do the uh, collect and press. Oh, okay, so you just re regress and keep going. All right, let's see it happen. I probably yeah. delayed you enough. Yeah, that, that way, in case in case I have a long roll, I still can build up. All right. Okay, that's a 314. That's the point. Nice. So I'm going to drop a dollar and get paid 60. All right. I lose this and I get paid 18. All right, so real quick, I'll just show you what my profit is right now. I'll show everybody out there what my profit is right now. I'm actually right just now. going to. So I'm going to go back to where I started. So I started with Use this to press inside, everything. And then I have two units with a four and ten. So right now, my profit for this roll would be 25. 35 45 so $51 profit right now, but I'm going to put 22 of it back at risk so I could keep rolling. So if I was to throw big red, I'd win a little over $30 on this hand. All right. I got everything pressed up, so I use that four to press up my other numbers. So I need, I'm not going to work on the come out, but I need you to roll a couple more numbers. All right. And, yes, I'm not working now on the come out, only on the first, uh, the first set of come All right. Here we go. All right. Here we go. Dice out. Hopefully I don't make any. Okay, that's a five, three, two, five. All right, I'm looking for two more rolls. You got to give me two more, Rick. All right, I'll do my best, buddy. <laughs> Go. I demand it. All right. Nice right. up. Five, one, six, baby. Okay. You like that one? Yeah, that's fine. Right, um, so I'm going to press that up. I, I haven't pressed that one up. I need one more. And then for me, I'm going to throw the dealers $3. I'm going to go ahead and do the double tap so I can get a $5 chip. I'm going to go ahead and press up my five and nine. Sorry, guys, I should have had my pass line bet. And I should have won that before. I don't know what I'm thinking. I would have had a $10 pass line bet because I'm playing at a $10 table. No one tipping the dealer, yeah. Well, I think Rick is yeah. now. <clears throat> my bad. All right, here we go. You need one more hit? Here we go. That's a craps, two, one, three. Okay. Well, so I'm going to pull down just because. Pretty good score there. Decent little score. Tell me when you're ready. 
Yeah, go ahead. Oh, I guess. Uh, all right, here I'm going to stick with 32 across. I was going to say, I guess I could see you on the camera, but it's a delay. <laughs> yeah. I'll be sitting here another 20 seconds. Okay. That is a hard eight, baby. Hard eight. I'm going to go ahead and select this one since I placed the first one. Okay, $7. And I'm probably uh, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 bucks on you. I'll probably kind of alternate pressing and collecting here. All right, here we go, dice out. That's a six five, yo. You confuse me when you call out the two numbers. Oh, sorry. That's okay, I know it's I know, habit. I'll stop. I'll stop. I'm so used to it because we, we look at the dice. Yeah, all you so. dice controllers. <laughs> or so we think. <laughs> Let's see. I'll try to check out the chat while you're rolling here. Hey, dice up. I'm not sure. Were you up on the ATS? No. No. Okay. I just started A6. 628. All right. And 8. A7. I'm going to go ahead and pop that up. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and press my eight, so I would win seven. I'm going to press my six and eight. I'm going to throw up a nickel, and we're going to go to 44 inside now. They're looking for a nine from you, Rick. All right, I throw nines, buddy. That's what they say. Here we go. Five, one, six. All right, I'll take that. I'm just going to collect that time. $14 hit. I'm going to go ahead and collect this one instead of pressing again. Okay, here we go. Dice out. Three, one, four. Don't do no good for me right now. Uh, I'm going to pay, drop one for 10 and we'll just press, I'm going to press the, actually, you know what? I think your roll is coming to an end. Yeah, I'm a little nervous. I shouldn't have said anything to you. I should have just pulled down a little bit, but I'm going to drop to 22 inside. I don't believe in that stuff, bro. In what stuff? I have no superstitions. I just keep rolling. Yeah. I don't have superstitions either, but I mean. At some point. Yeah, it's got to come soon. There's the aces right there. Okay. I can't roll forever. Or can I? Yeah, you just hit that two. All right, here we go. That's a hard four. Damn, I'm not scoring now. I'm hitting outside numbers. See, this is where you're like, well, man, I should go back up on it, but I don't know. We'll just stick it out here. Uh, yes, you're right. So how many guys total have you – so if you're, if you're interested in doing this and you can Skype, how many how many tables have you actually played with before? What's, like, the maximum number? Um, George had six, I believe. There's a 6 four, ten. Damn, I ain't hitting nothing. <laughs> At one time, George had six going. Okay. Hey, yeah, uh, also, do you mind if I tell them about the fantasy craps on Sundays or no? Yeah, that's fine. Well, why don't you tell Anybody? them while I'm shooting? Okay. okay, I'll let them know. Of course, if you keep rolling, this is great. Although I'm not winning anything currently. I know, that's what I said. I'm, I'm ready to move to the outside. There's a 426. That's what we need. There we go. All right, um, so with this one, Jeremy, I'm going to go ahead and take that $14. And hopefully continue my roll, but I'm going to cover the 4 and 10 with 1. And I'm going to do 1C, one 1E. One I'm going to rack $2. So now, no matter what, if Big Red don't come, I'm going to start making some money. Stay the course, Jeremy. <laughs> That's funny. It's probably good advice. Hey, dice out. Craps 3. That's my $7 win right there, baby. Okay, so $7. I'm going to go ahead and collect this one. Use that. Replace that. 
Hopefully the stream is running smooth for you guys. I know there's a little bit of audio issue, but hopefully the video is pretty solid for you. Six, three, nine. There we go. All right, page That's seven. Your nine. You already pulled it down. No, no, no. I got every, I got everything covered again. Okay, so that's fourteen dollar win. I'm gonna go ahead and do uh, another C and an E. I'm gonna go ahead and press up my eight and my nine one. Yep, it's smooth. Okay, that's good. Little echo. Yeah, the echoes. Yeah, I got. I'm gonna have to figure out how to be able to listen to him. I don't know. I might have to buy like a headphone extension cord or something. All right, dive stop. I'm not chasing. I got I got plenty of profit here, and now I'm just kind of taking advantage of a long roll if I can. That's a craps three right there, so I win on my crap check. I'm gonna go ahead and collect that one. What is the fantasy? So um, Rick will talk about fantasy craps here in a minute. Whenever I'm rolling, he'll have some free time to check in the chat and let you guys know. AirPods, yeah. I, I can do that. Can you hook AirPods to your computer? Six, four, ten, Jeremy. All right. I was playing that E, so I'd have lost both of these. I'm gonna drop a dollar. Yep. One for ten. I'm just gonna collect. I'm gonna go ahead and press this one. I'm gonna go ahead and press up my nine. I'm gonna do a two dollar C, one dollar E, collect a dollar on this roll. Okay, here we go. Four one five. That's the point. So I was gonna pay seven. I'll go ahead and just collect that. Point off. So win fourteen here, and then ten for my pass lane bet. I'm off on this come out look. Okay, so you can't connect AirPods to the computer. Y'all have to do that for steal my wife's. I don't have any. I think she has some. You ready? Okay, here we go. Picture not in focus. Is that my my picture or is it Rick's picture is not in focus? I'll wait. I'll wait for you. Go no, ahead. go ahead. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm ready. This is, I'm just kind of reading the chat. Six is the point. You know what, Jeremy? I have been rolling a while. I'm going to go back down to 22 and I'm going to start again building. You there? Yep. I should use a triple lux. I don't know the triple lux. I'm going to, I'm going to learn it and maybe that'll be one of my next videos. My next, one of, one of my next couple. I know a lot of people want to see that. So both look focused. Okay. Both sides, both good. We better, better not. Yeah, I'm using a four five five four set. Ooh, seven out. Did I not come down in time? That was a seven out there. Well, that's perfect. Come down. There we go. Good roll. All right, you're up. Let me go ahead and cover that. I'm gonna do that same thing, and I'm on on the come out roll. I just need three rolls to make money. Well, that simple little roll made me 110 bucks or so. Not bad. Not bad. Let's go home. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, I can still run through the rest of my bankroll, so that's I'm going to kind of run through it once and see what happens. I don't know what I'm going to play here, though. I'm going to make it up as I go along. I'm on on the come out roll. All right, you ready? So, uh, Fantasy Craps, guys, if you guys aren't subscribed to George from CY, it's just George CY every Sunday. Dice are moving, coming out. Groups of the Crap Nation that play. Sometimes I play. Jeremy's going to start playing periodically. Um, same bet. We've got Sleepy, Bird Dog. There's a bunch of guys in there that we just kind of get together and have fun, and George uh, streams it. Five. Five's the point, Rick. Mark the five. So I get 21 for that. I'm pressing on these. I'm going to place the 6 and 8. 
I'm gonna add. Uh, I'm gonna press up my. I'll just do double odds here. All right. Maybe I'll cover the we nine. Got Malcolm, that's why he joins us. All right, dice are moving. Two aces in both places. Take that. That's fourteen dollars, baby. So I lose this one. I get four. I'm gonna go ahead and press up my eight two units. All right, I'm ready. All right, here we go. Aces in both places again. All right, I'll take it. I'm coming down to 22. So that's a $14 win, not 24. Oh, yeah, 14. Yeah, that's and true. There's a couple down. guys from Craps Nation in the uh, chat. So if you have any questions, just shoot them out there. They'll answer them for you. Yeah, I'm coming down to 22, and I'm going to start doing the uh, double tap with me. All right, dice are moving. Seven. Good, good roll, because I actually do. <laughs> good roll. <laughs> I, won, I won probably 30 bucks. I made no money and lost it all. Terrible roll, Just terrible roll. Get three rolls, brother, with this strategy, but it's a big risk, man. You're losing 100 bucks if you can't get three rolls. Well, 94, but hopefully we can get at least three, which doesn't happen all the time, believe me. <laughs> If you watched my last live video, I was pissed because I put up 130 and I point seven with 130 up there. And then I rebought in with 160 and I had a pretty good roll. I ended up making $469 on that one roll. Yeah, exactly. If color up shooting, you need to be on the don'ts. So, um, yeah, I'm playing with Rick. He has a channel, Let It Roll. It's a good channel. I put it In the description, you'll find the link to it. Go ahead and hit him up, subscribe, that sort of thing. You know, all the good stuff. All right, come out. I'm on. I'm working. Three, two, five. Just gonna go. I'm gonna go with a simple twenty-two inside. I should have had two on here and one on there, so I would have lost that. I get twenty-one for getting here, so I'm going to pin that in for five. That way I can replace my $2 C, $1 E. Actually, I'm going to play the cum a little bit, play with some cum. <laughs> All right, here we go. Four, five, nine, baby, I just touched it up. So I lose this, but there was six units on there, so that's a $42 win. I'm just going to collect a little bit and use my place bet as odds. <clears throat> so I'm going to go ahead and press up oh, my eight. Oh, follow up with another come. I'm going to put six units on my eight, and I'm going to go ahead and put... Sagear 99, new player. Love the channel. Thank you. Appreciate it. I'm going to do eight units on my nine, and I'll do seven units on my eight. Gotta put my yeah, I can play some hard ways, but my, my laptop's in the way. All right, here we go. Hit that, hit that nine or that eight, baby. Come on. See a nine. Dice bounce backwards. Four, three, seven. I made. I lost ninety-four on that roll. Come on, brother. Dang, it popped up and spun backwards. I mean, last come gets paid. The bad thing about this strategy, though, is you have to have three rolls because I press. I don't collect on the first two. But it, it can put your head pretty good if you can get past three rolls. I'm gonna. Right. I'm gonna try my uh, dealer John strategy. Again? Often, I don't know how long you're running your show. Are we going again? Often known as my favorite strategy. Uh, do you have time? It's 7.30. Yeah, 
Yeah, let's. We could go. You tell me when you're done. My stream don't start till eight fifteen. I pushed it back fifteen minutes. Okay. So, so afterwards, you guys could check out Rick's uh, Rick's stream. He's doing a premiere video. Five dollars super chat from Robert Barnes. Just showing some support. Be sure to split it with Rick. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it very much. All right. I'm gonna show you guys how to roll now. I'm on. All right. Here we go. Four. Four is the point. Like the four. So I'm going to get the field. Drop the six and eight. I should have had a $2 C, $1 E. I would have lost that. So I win 18. I'm going to go ahead and replace that and cover my nine. All right, I'm ready. All right, dice are moving. Here we go. Six. Six hard. $21. Lose here. This gets paid. And actually, I'm going to go go ahead and press my six and make another more some more farming in the field. Ready? ready. Dice are moving. Here we go. Six, six easy. Nice, all right. You got me past my Who's here? Re -roll, so. This is going to pay down, 14. Down. I'm going to go ahead and drop the dealer one for 15. And that's going to get me to place the rest of the numbers. I'm ready whenever you are. All right, dice are moving. 10, 10 hard. All right. Drop the dealer one. One for 10. I'm going to go ahead and rack. I need to collect my initial investment back. All right, here we go. Six. No, seven. I, I was trying to think of like a creative call. Seven, seven out. <laughs> You're missing six, one, seven. That's all right. I made some money. I made no money. All right. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to be on on the come out. Should I pay the, play the don'ts on Rick or what? Maybe this will be our last roll here. Okay. okay. That'll work. So I'll get, actually go ahead and play a line bet. All right, here we go. Come out, roll. Four. Point is four. Go three times an odds. I'm just going to assume I'm on a three, four, five times odds table, which I would never normally play because place bets play more. Um, I'll go ahead and put these in odds. We'll just do a combat. We'll play it this way. Okay, dice out. Nice to hit that nine twice. That's an eight. Five, three, eight. Okay. So win 21. We need one more roll. No, I shouldn't have said that. People always say the dice can hear you, so I should have said I need five more Of course the dice can hear you. Everybody knows that. It's the first rule you learn in crafts, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> now let's see what happens. People are gonna be laughing if I throw big red now. Don't be saying that. I got. I'm you. I'm doing playing max odds over here. All right, I got you. Here's your four, baby. No, that's a yo. That's a yo six five. Like that. All right, so I win fifteen for that. So now I'm coming down. That's my three rolls. So I'm coming down to twenty two.
turn 200 into 1290 so far. No matter what happens now, I can't lose. I just got to get past the three rolls. Sure. Okay, here we go. Dice out. 415. Oh, I didn't take down the rest of mine. I would only have one unit on there, so I'm not going to count that. That should have been a $7 win, which I'm going to throw them $3, though, so I can press up my 5 and 9. All right, here we go. Dice out. There it is, hard four. Nice. That was for you, buddy. Let's get 10 there and 20 here. Okay, come out, roll. Didn't know you were placing come bets. Yeah, I just switched it up. Doing a little three-point molly here. Five, one, six is the point. And I don't have enough, so I want to pull from here for the rest of my odds to get full odds here. Yeah, let me take down that. What app or website, y'all? So we're, we're, me and Rick are currently using Skype, but really, I don't know, there's a bunch of different kind of video conferencing software. So basically, just video conference with, you know, your buddies or friends. 617. What? Every time my dice jumps in the air, bro, I don't know. You can tell when you're throwing a seven. That was, I hit way I took a big hit ball. there, huh? Dang it. All right. That's all she wrote, brother. That was fun, though. Yeah, I appreciate it. So, yeah, so that's, that, I mean, that's basically it. If you use some sort of video conferencing software and you want to add, you know, one, two, three friends, it kind of works out nice. You get a chance to breathe and kind of think about betting while the other guy's shooting, and then uh, you get your chance to shoot. It, it kind of works out really, really well. What do you think, Rick? Yeah, I love it, man. It's honestly, it almost feels like you're at the casino because everybody's taking their turn shooting. We're all interacting. It's uh, it's a blast, man. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So I hope you guys liked it. If you have any questions, you can leave them down in the comments um, as far as the logistics of how that works. But really, it's as simple as just, you know, using your favorite video conferencing app and then hooking up with your friend. Um, yeah, and that's about it. Anything else you want to add, Rick? Oh, yeah, definitely check out his channel. He's going to do a uh, premiere here um, here in a few minutes, but I put the link to his channel down below, and check him out. He does some good stuff. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I do a lot of live video from the casino. Actually, I have Jeremy with me from about five months ago. That went by fast, man. It's been five months, but that's on my homepage, too, if you want to see Jeremy throw from a real casino. <laughs> yeah, we got to do that again. Yeah. Here in, what is it, 15 minutes? What time is it? Half hour or so? Yeah, it's a little after 7.30. Yeah, so about 45 minutes. At 8.15 my time, I'm going to do that premiere of one of my live videos from the casino if anybody wants to join. I appreciate Jeremy. Oh, the other thing, guys, um, I joined Jeremy's uh, Color Up Club, and I love it. It's it's really cool. There's some really cool people on there. He has Discord. so Yeah, the Discord's new. We just kind of opened that up and... Um, I mean, people are really digging it. They're getting in. There. There's a lot of a lot of back and forth. It's pretty cool. So I'm using that Dude, for the I'm community down, aspect I'm, of it. I'm absolutely loving your Color Up Club. So anybody out there, dude? I mean, if you guys if you guys like craps, join his club. It's it's definitely worth it. Yeah, it's a great I mean, way. A Everyone kind of in there is really our craps fanatics. So I mean, if you don't kind of know anyone, um, definitely. You can get in there. I think I have it on the screen, but you can connect with someone really easily there and then, and then kind of do this yourself. You know, these, these days are going to be, I think a lot of us are going to have some free time on our hands. And, you know, sadly, some of us are going to have job issues and whatever, but um, uh, at least we can have a little, little fun here at the craps table. A little getaway. Thanks again, Jeremy. I appreciate you having me on your channel, brother. All right. Thanks, you guys. And uh, until next time, good luck on coloring up.